Out there, Terry L. Fossum, once again, thanks so much for joining me. What I want to talk about now is fear. People say, face your fears. And I'm here to tell you, absolutely not. Do not face your fears. And here's why. If you face your fears, that means you're focusing on them. Whatever you focus on gets bigger, right? Whatever you focus on gets more prominent. It gets more powerful in your mind. If you're focusing on your fears, you give them power. Instead, what I'm going to recommend is you focus on your goal. You focus on your destination. You focus on where you want to get to. This fear is merely an obstacle in the way. Let me give you an example. I was very blessed to represent all of Boy Scouts of America on a survival reality show called Kicking and Screaming on Fox Network. Night. Please, please watch the champagne. Ten total divas are packing their bags for the adventure. Welcome to the jungle. Oh my God, you're Louie. Of a lifetime. Oh, ew. ew. <laughs> they must survive a merciless jungle, <laughs> paired with hardcore survivalists. We even have the Boy Scouts of America. And part of that was we each had a partner, and I had a, this amazing partner by the name of Natalie. Now, one of our challenges was we had to eat a grub. Now, this wasn't a grub. I've eaten grubs before doing survival in the Amazon jungle. No, 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 no. This was a grub. Cigar size, live and squirming, guts squirt out of your mouth when you chomp on it, slimy grub. Yeah. Ooh. Now, when I was talking to uh, Natalie right beforehand, she goes, we're going to have a problem because I have a gag reflex. And they told us if we don't finish it, if we spit any out or if we throw up, we're out of that competition and maybe out of the entire show. So I said, okay, Natalie, here's what we're going to do. Whatever you do, don't look at the grub. Don't do it. And the host, Hannah Simone, is going to try to get you to do that more than likely. She's going to go, oh, look at that. And she did. Oh, look at that grub. Isn't that disgusting? All that. But Natalie wasn't having it. She wasn't looking at that grub at all. She was focusing where we had talked about, which is on the children for the, the charity that she represents, that she really loves, focusing on those children cheering her on. So all she had in her mind was those children cheering her on, not this slimy thing. So how did it go? She's moving, no! Okay, they're both moving. They're both moving. Oh, no! I'm so sorry! Natalie did fantastic. It was down in nothing flat. I had a little bit more of a challenge with it, though, because I chomped down on it, no problem at all, got squirted out of my mouth, sure enough, but uh, the head, I kind of tucked over in the side. You know, if you've eaten a piece of steak, you, you kind of push the gristle over to the side of your mouth, and you'll just worry about spitting it out later when nobody's looking. Well, that's what I did with the head. The problem is, they said we had to eat the whole thing, so I remembered it was there. I crunched down on the head and suddenly it all came crashing back. I focused on my fear. I focused on that nasty thing. And I almost started to try to throw up a little bit. I had to push that away. Do not focus on your fear. Focus on your goal. Focus back on all those scouts watching me and cheering me on and everything. And I was able to finish like that. Whatever you do, do not focus on your fear. Don't face your fears. Face your goals. Focus on that. These things, these fears, they're just something to get past, get out of the way. Because if your focus is strong enough on your goal, on what you want to achieve, on what you want to gain, what you want to do, nothing else matters. I hope this has been helpful for you. If it has, please like, comment, go ahead and follow me, and share. There might be somebody else out there that needs to see this as well. And as always, come join me on TerryLFossum.com. I'd love to see you there. Until then, keep up the good fight.